So here we have a typical motor that's working at constant speed, driving the raw water pumps that provide the pressurized water to the factory ring main. The demand for water varies. And as that demand varies, this pump at constant output relieves the pressure through a pressure relief valve back into the reservoir. Here we have an opportunity to use a variable speed control to control the speed of this pump so that it reduces to match the pressure requirements in the ring main. Here we have the variable speed drive that's been fitted to this motor. It allows us to run the pump at variable speed so that we can regulate the pressure in the raw water ring main. This is the pressure regulator and allows us to control the actual pressure of delivery very, very closely and gives us better process control. This box cost about £3,000 to fit, yet it's saving £3,500 a year. That's a payback period of 10 months. The reason to use variable speed drives is that if we can reduce the speed of a motor by only 20%, we halve the energy consumption. The tip here is to look around all of your motors and identify where variable speed controls can be fitted.